transit said, let's reduce our revenue by hundreds of thousands of dollars, but then the next report is, I need millions of dollars more. An increased level of crime at Calgary LRT stations has prompted City Hall to try and find strategies to tackle safety issues, including a committee meeting Wednesday exploring implementing a closed system. Recommendations meant to be a first step to address the safety problem. This is a very um, quick, short-term solution. In order to explore um, a lot of the other things we're hearing from my colleagues, it's long term. And to be honest, we don't have time. In addition to the recent increased amount of peace officers, they are now also looking at fair gates. Some councillors challenging the report. We've only studied gates from the perspective of fair evasion. No one has studied fair gates of whether or not it improves safety. The studies that have been done with Fairgates show that there is a higher perception of safety on that system. The preliminary study for a closed system anticipates a cost of $567 million, a budget transit says it doesn't have. This will pass and um, we will move to council. If there's things that need to be changed, we'll do that then. But I would say that there's still some question around the cost of the closed system. We have a massive problem that needs to be addressed with creative thinking that needs to address social issues, it needs to address uh, infrastructure issues, and until we start going, what is the root problem we're trying to solve, all the money in the world will not fix this. The hope is to have a new plan ready by September, potentially in place for winter. In Calgary, Silvia Naranjo, City News.